design for me is simply a way of life. Just the way we aspire to breathe good air, drink and eat good water and food, the same way for us living means living with good design around us. So it could be our homes, our workplaces, our places of recreation, or even most importantly, what I believe is public design, our public spaces being designed well. Unless we have that around us, I don't know how as a society we can call ourselves progressive. I believe India today possesses some of the best talent that you can find in product design. It gives me great satisfaction to see that in India, we have graduated from a society which believed that the youth can only be productively engaged if they become an engineer or a lawyer or a doctor. Today, there are a plethora of options for our young youth to go into and pursue fields of their own passion. Product design is one of them. And I think product design is such an important discipline because it surrounds us all over. All the products that we see, whether a chair, a table, or a pen stand, or a laptop, or anything else for that matter, are products around us. So good design for products is essential. And I'm happy to see that there's so much talent in abundance in India. I feel that in India, the future of local design is extremely bright. We are now evolving ourselves as a society. I think we are becoming more and more design conscious. So whether it is the incorporation of khadi in our garments, or it is the incorporation of vernacular and sustainable design elements in our design world, I think we are becoming more conscious about it. And therefore, the significance of local design has become very important. The incorporation of local materials in our architecture. And I believe that this direction is not only responsible designing from a sustainability point of view, but also I think it's culturally very, very significant that we are recognizing what our local uh, resources have to offer to us and incorporating them in our design. So I find this a very promising one.